Hi folks, it's me, Manic Mark, coming to you from the Bunker System, located underneath the Art Bell Found, somewhere in the jungles of the Midwest. And today I'm coming to you with short finds, short Friday finds. And uh, I, I've been working the past couple of days. I'm achy and I'm tired. So what I'm going to do first is I'm coming in and I'm going to steal some energy from you. Back away from your monitor if you don't have any extra energy to spare. We'll start with the local newspaper, which they threw once again for free into my uh, driveway. And the last time we did this, we went straight to the uh, Help Wanted ads. Do, 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 do. Demolition laborers needed. Must have transportation and neat appearance. I'm not making that up. Demolition laborers needed must have transportation and neat appearance. Eight dollars an hour. I almost want to go interview for that job just to find out what in the hell are they talking about? If you're going to go bust something up, what the hell difference does it make what you look like? <laughs> Holy crap, $8 an hour. I want to work $8 an hour breaking stuff to pieces. Mm. Actually, sometimes that could be fun. Like just an hour of it. I'd pay somebody $8 for an hour of breaking something up just because it's fun. I don't know if I want to do it all day for $8 an hour. Window cleaner. Experienced window cleaner needed. Valid driver's license. Drug test required. Qualified applicants only window cleaner, qualified applicants. Mm. Can't do that. Mm -hmm -hmm. Distrit distributors needed for meat, a meat company, hiring drivers, no door-to-door -door sales, no over-the-road driving. Benefit package includes health plan, vacation, paid holidays, competitive wages. There you go, you can deliver meat! Mm -mm -mm. Oh yeah. So I put hamburger in a skillet, and I cut up avocados, and I just I just um, uh, fried the hamburger and the avocados with some maple syrup. Mm -mm -mm. I know it sounds horrible, but it's not. I'm telling you right now, I like it. And and the idea comes thanks to my good friend Liz, who's on a, a gluten-free diet, which I have yet to. Manage anyway. Get to the records. What day is it? It's record day. Short finds. Record day. I got out early enough that I could stop and look for records, even though I was tired and achy. Oh, I wanted to stop. I should put this part up front. Hello, new viewers. I got new subscribers. I guess that's what you call them. And oh, uh, I have so many sub subscribers now, and the the view count's going up. I really don't know what I'm doing that was different than you know 800 videos ago. Some of it I know. It's yeah. Ooh, the furnace is running too. Anyway, the new subscribers, uh, it takes a while for me. What, you know, I don't know. I don't even know. It's just, who are you? Who are you, subscribers? I have no idea. You gotta leave a comment, say, get, leave your phone number and address so I can get to know you better. <laughs> don't do that, because then, oh, I shouldn't say that, because somebody will leave their phone number and address, and I'll f feel re re responsible for going to visit them no matter where they live. <laughs> Unannounced, by the way. And you, and you don't want to do that. Um, the thing of it is, I, I need to, you need to just, if you want to approach me through comments, it may take a while, because they've got to get comfortable. I don't want you to be more crazy than me. <laughs> I'm not going to talk to you. Anyway, mm. Let's go. Let's start with the Weavers on tour. Who are the Weavers? Does anybody know who they are? Vanguard recording. Pete Seeger. Is that actual the actual Pete Seeger? Or is that just somebody named Pete Seeger? I swear to God, this Lee Hayes guy right here. I got a Private Press album. It just looks like the guy. It can't possibly be the guy. Anyway, I picked that up. The Weavers on tour. And there's the Century Plaza, and there's the world's greatest jazz band standing in front of the Century Plaza. The Living Trio, honey. Uh, it's like the Living Strings, the Living This, Living That. Uh, but I had, uh, remember 
earlier, was it earlier this week? The last record row had the Beatles album with the, the toy wind up Beatle on the front. That turned out to be amazing. That, that album, I couldn't believe it. It was total space age, Be Beatle covers. They were wonderful. And what, these guys did one of them, the Living Trio. So I'm excited about that. I have no idea who this sh son of Schmielson is. May all. Uh, the record's in pretty good shape. There's a little shelfware on the cover. Mexican Joe, the living marimbas. It's thick, thick zither music by Ruth Welcome. Normally her photograph doesn't appear on the cover, but there she is. That's actually Ruth. I don't have this one south of the border. She's playing some southern stuff. Don't laugh at me, F and T, an F and T record. Probably reissues. Don't know, but I don't. Ha I don't haven't heard them do Miserloo, so I had to pick it up just for that. And this looks like fun. I don't know what I'm going to feature, but I'm thinking maybe it's going to come from this album. This is the late '50s Somerset. Eddie Burt. There's a man with two first names. Eddie Burt. Play the tiki drummer. Hello, new people. I never know what I'm going to do, but after three or four videos, pretty much I do the same thing over and over and over again. <laughs> Thank you. 